लेट्स कम टू द टॉपिक वाट इज एक्चुअली द क्यू एंड टाइप्स ऑफ मैसेज इन दट हाउ मेनी टाइप्स ऑफ मैसेज आर देयर इन वाट आर द कम्युनिकेशन बिटवीन हैपनिंग बिटवीन देम तो क्यू इज ऑलरेडी टोल्ड यू द क्यू इज नथिंग जस्ट ए बॉक्स क्यू इज जस्ट ए बॉक्स विच हैज सम कैपेसिटी टू स्टोर मैसेज लेटेस्ट लेक ए बॉक्स एंड क्यू इज जस्ट ए बॉक्स and it has capacity to store some uh, if i set a, a, a storage of 1000 it can store 1000 message yeah if i set a storage location of a, a storage quantity 10000 it will store 10000 message if i set something lay, length that uh, 400 mb then it can say it can store one message of length 400 mb Uh, this is the uh, limits we can set uh, this facility later we'll show you how can you can say it and uh, let's come on the uh, topic uh, uh, type of messaging uh, there is two type of messaging uh, mainly we have synchronous communication and asynchronous communication so what is difference between them if you think and if you, if i can say you see simple uh, difference between synchronous and asynchronous asynchronous is uh, just a uh, one way communication if application a is application a is sending some information to application b and that's the asynchronous communication uh, if applic if application b is sending some response to application a that's the synchronous communication this is a simple difference let's come to the de definition and we will uh, learn that in details in synchronous model the two application exchange information by waiting the partner application to available and the sending information jaise ki uh, application a is sending the information and application b is uh, uh, just receiving the application the in synchronous model uh, applic both application exchange the information between Each other. If partner application is available in region, including if it is busy communication with each other, information cannot be sent. In case, let us take example. Application B is down. Then application A, if try to send the application to application B, the information will be not be sent. Let us let, let some live example. All HTTP web service. You know that the HTTP web service. Uh, it is a, a, a real time web service, and uh, it uses the uh, Uh, synchronous communication when application is say, a sends uh, some information using the http communication it sends the uh, uh, message to the application b and again uh, it gets a response back from the application b about the of the message what he sends that's the call the http communication few more uh, real examples if you are talking with some person with face to face and if you are saying something the he will get some reply from him that's also a synchronous communication if you are talking on the phone calls and you are getting some response from the person that you are talking on the phone call uh, this is also a synchronous communication if you are talking on teams that's the also a synchronous communication where you get a reply from the uh, the person who are talking to you <coughs> let's say example of uh, asynchronous communication asynchronous communication is something uh, different that's a already told you application a is sending some information to application b then application b may be available not available that's does not matter message will be sent by application a and application b will don't care of the what message happened it does not application a message bhej dega application b ko jo hai available rahe na rahe application a ko bhi matlab nahi hai it they do not take care of the message and they don't require the response back if in case uh, it uh, application b wants to send a response then it sends but it is not required it is not required real time you know uh, synchronous communication is also known as real time discussion because it, as soon as it is sending a request it is getting a response but in asynchronous communication it is uh, uh, just uh, opposite Uh, application A. If you go to definition, placing a web server MQ infrastructure between two application allow the communication application. We can achieve the asynchronous communication by placing a MQ. 
if I let's say MQ just when application A is sending some information message will wait for the few minutes for here and send to the application B in case application B is down message will be wait in M, uh, MQ that is Q message Q till the application B is up that's the asynchronous communication it is not a real time uh, it is not a real time uh, uh, communication in case application B wants to send some reply back to the application A they may say but it does not require the application B send some reply back to the uh, application A application placed where in application place information of the partner in the message queue the partner application process the information when it is available if required it can send them a reply back to the ordinator the application do not need to be concentrated between the communication of recovery failure then if you take example that we use the mq mq is also a mq is a asynchronous if you if we send a sms message to someone then SMS message will if in case uh, uh, in case the uh, destination person to for whom you sending the message is unavailable application is down then message will be uh, sent but it will not be transferred to the application B as soon as application B is up the SMS you send it will be transferred to that person's maybe he he, he reply back to you but did this does not uh, to confirm that application uh, the person B you, you send the message he send reply back to you that's the uh, difference between synchronous and asynchronous communication uh, <coughs> later we will discuss more about the IBM MQ in detail